part of Lioness, I think the thing that really spoke to me was when I started reading the very first pages, like I just started crying because there's just something so deep about her passion that she had for these people. For me, seeing miracles like that, like crazy miracles that we, we just can't even comprehend, like it just, it blows my mind that that's something that she was experiencing every single day. She's a rare individual and she's incredible. What she accomplished with her life is astonishing and inspiring. In many ways, Irene was the unlikely missionary. She came from a dysfunctional background. She had looked into different religions. She had had sexual abuse and suffered at the hands of people as a child. And yet, God took her to Uganda and she had this amazing ministry with these um, children. And um, we now see the results of that in her book and also obviously in the foundation that exists today. Just seeing the journey that she took um, to where it is now and the, the faith mountains that she would have had to climb, um, you know, they just uh, blow my mind as far as what, you know, what she was able to achieve. She's so tough to be able to do what she did, and but gee, did she do it well. It's one of those fulfilling books that would get anybody off doing something if they weren't. It was just a joy, sad, it was life, it was everything. Oh, I could read it again and again. I just think it's an inspiration to just see the way she's worked with these children, changed lives, you know, she tells it what's and all. But she was totally committed to these kids, totally committed to what God was going to do for them. And she was broken by them because she herself had been broken in her own life. And I, I really got that she was someone very special and you know, possibly a once in a lifetime experience, not for the faint hearted, heart of a lioness. Yeah, she, she was a fighter. She, she fought every inch of the way, and she had, a, she had a great heart. There was nothing fake about her, nothing conventional. She was, she was real, and we were all made bigger and more brave as a result of knowing her. Well, everyone, every single person should read it, Christian and non-Christian. It's just, it's a thrilling story, whether you've got faith or not. It's just absolutely wonderful. Irene is a, she's a fearless woman an obedient woman, strong, kind-hearted. It's the children in the book that make me cry. It's the children in the book that make me emotional. Children that don't have a hope, and she gave them one.